We are now just two weeks away from election night in Iowa. Locally, several school districts are asking their taxpayers for more money. Yeah, in Bettendorf, the community school district wants to upgrade two schools, and it means property taxes could jump by more than 20 percent. Tonight, News 8's Cesar Sanchez tells us about the classroom upgrades and how much they could cost homeowners. We're going to be going over... Um... Dr. Michelle Morse wants her schools to be up to standards. The standards in education have changed. She says Bettendorf High School and Middle School are in need of some upgrades. We would be able to create spaces, educational learning spaces that are collaborative, um, that cultivate those job skills that our employers in the community are telling us they want to see. Since the buildings open, classrooms have seen little to no changes. Over time, just like with a house, buildings will age. Um, the infrastructure needs to be addressed. Now, the district is hoping to gain support for a general obligation bond to bring the necessary changes for its buildings. Some of our ceilings in our middle school are very, very low, um, creating the challenges with replacing the much needed roof. But these changes will cost homeowners, increasing property taxes by nearly $3 per every $1,000 taxable value. Our current levy is um, at $12.38 per $1,000 of that taxable value. Um, that $2.70 would put us just a little over $15. The rise in taxes could influence a voter's decision, but every vote until March 7th will impact these students. In Bettendorf, Cesar Sanchez, WQAD News 8. And to learn more about the project, the district is hosting a meeting right now at Bettendorf Middle School and tomorrow at Bettendorf High School at 6 o'clock.